All right, hello everyone. It has been a while. Uh, my name is the Obsidian Walker or Hudson, whichever one you choose. And welcome to a little experiment we're gonna run tonight. This is uh, Late Night Giggles, and that might be a weird name, but let me explain. We are going to be doing a podcast Let's Play combination. We're gonna be doing a gameplay combination with a podcast where it's it's going to be a very very long let's play where we don't progress in anything and we just talk it's pretty much that <laughs> and that's why it's going to be an experiment i want to see if people like this people like the topics we bring up um other than that i'm here with my buddy kyle who is currently stuck in that tree and my buddy zach uh and we're gonna chit chat for 30 to 40 minutes maybe an hour it depends um, but I hope you guys enjoy and let me unmute and see what they're talking about. Wow, you guys are talking about nothing. I'm actually surprised. Shit. You, you should have given us an intro. I was so planning on just saying, like, the moment I heard you come back, just being like, Zach, it's okay if you come out of the closet. He won't care. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Uh, day, night time, day time, night time, okay. Oh wait! Well, I turned it to challenge. I don't. I know didn't what know. Challenge. I didn't know what challenge wait, mode is either. Wait, what there, is this? What, there's there's arrows leading down to the basement. Oh, it's oh it's love. What the hell? Uh, let's not. Let's not. Do okay. Yeah. Whatever this. Yeah. This hell is. Please, please turn it back to nighttime. <laughs> okay. So, without further ado, let's just pick a fucking level. That's fucking gay. <laughs> Shut up, you. <laughs> Oh. Nice. I'm gonna go to this one. Okay. This one's gonna make you hate yourself. I, you know what? This whole game is gonna make me hate myself. No, trust me. This level in particular is gonna make you hate yourself. Okay, fair. Okay, so does anyone want to start on a topic? <laughs> yeah. Do you see that gold piece of shit over there? <laughs> That's. Uh, what? Oh, it's there's a gold coin every round. If someone touches oh. it, death comes for us all. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna put this here so we can get the box. Does this require a lot of sprint jumping? Don't, don't put it. Okay, I was like, don't put it, fucking. On the box? <laughs> I'm not that much of an asshole. Probably. You, you totally are. Fuck. Oh shit! <laughs> I got hit by the wall. Zach, we need that box. Yeah, get the box, please. Sprint jump. We believe in you. There you go. Okay, so. Also, try and get the coin. <gasps> Ooh, that's cool. Ooh, lava level. Nah, I'm okay. Um. So, one of the things I wanted to talk about with Kyle is um, things that scared me as a child. Ah, uh, yes. Because we talked about this the other day, and you're probably going to be disappointed. Why are we in this? Oh, shit, he got the flower. I'm going to choose the tiny box. Where's the goal? Oh, it's right here. Yeah, it's that. I'm going to put it right Oh, here. you're just making that. I was going to do the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> that flower is so happy. Why would it slap the crap out of anyone? Cause it has it. What's the sprint button on controller again? Uh, on controller. Oh, it's I have it's no it's idea. X. It's X. I figured it out and then died. Whoops. So, um, oh, I I do know the flowers. Okay. Oh, you got your little dance. Okay. So, um, Zach, since you weren't in this conversation, one of the things that scared me as a child was the uh, aliens from Mars Attacks. <laughs> I forgot oh, okay. about that. <laughs> and Kyle immediately said afterwards that those were the most CGI fake things that he's ever seen. But me as a, a person who never watched horror- fuck. <laughs> who never watched horror movies. I- I was t like, anything with their brain exposed was just like, no, that's- Yeah. It's just- uh. Well, cause Kyle, you grew up with horror movies. Th so that I, is true. Yes. I don't know, what the heck is this thing? <laughs> that is a wrecking ball? No, the thing I grabbed, this. What oh, is this? Oh, that throws paper airplanes that you can ride, like oh. a stallion. Oh, I'm... T <laughs> it's not weird. I hate you so much, sometimes. Um, <laughs> so I... Oh, God. Fall out the gate. Oh, God. <laughs> ah, oh, God. <laughs> I got hit by the puck. <laughs> we. <laughs> the crouching is adorable. Um, so, yeah, it was, it was also, didn't they, what else did they do in that movie that scared the crap out of me? 
They, they switched exploded? The, they switched the woman's head with a dog, which was creepy. Ah, uh, yes. That, that was creepy to me. Have you ever seen that video of, like, the Russians that claim to have brought the decapitated dog head back to life? What? No, just me? Okay, never mind. No, no, explain this. What? I've never... <laughs> Uh, what so website were you on? No, no, no. Th this was a big thing of scientific debate a while back. Okay. Because they weren't sure if it was a real video or not. How do it you was tell? Of Soviet scientists experimenting with a decapitated Fuck. dog head to I see if put... they could bring it back to life. That's weird. By stimulating the brain enough, and so there was video of it, and it's old, shitty footage, and so they can't actually tell well, if okay. it's real or fake. That's fair, but also, what's the definition of back to life? Like, moving? Like, or... the head was... In, in the video, the head is able to move, um, but and is... it, it actually tried to eat food, which just okay. came out of the open neck at the end and was absolutely disgusting. Okay, so it, my I was going to say definition of back to life is moving, but also... Oh, God, Zach, why did you do that? You're welcome. Oh, You're no! Bad man. Just made it easier for Kyle to win, but like I was gonna say, bringing it so we could move again isn't really back to life. But if it tried to eat, then that is back to life. But then it still questions in the video, and he fucking won. He questions in the. That's interesting. Yeah. So it it was horrifying. It was oh, it really sounds gross. horrifying. I'm and just like, like they had all sorts of machines to funnel its blood through, and st I just was absolutely disgusting. It's just fascinating to me that yeah. that's a scientific debate. Also, like, hey, let, let, let me do that. My points are worth a little less. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, we got the volcano. Yeah, oh wait, so... wait, but we can go to two places that. Do we want to do the new place, or we do we uh, want to do the places? Let's, let's, let's okay, split let's do the, the vote. Oh, no, we can split the vote. And okay, see, wait, let wait. Fate decide. Yep. Okay. Well, we'll go over here. Um, so another thing that scared me that I thought of recently was of, um, there is a, <laughs> this is going to sound so stupid, um, oh, looks like we're going to Metal Plant, um, so one of the things that scared me as a child, if you remember, uh, Arthur, well, I mean, I, I would <laughs> hope you would recommend Arthur. Yeah, yeah, I, I remember you're, Arthur. <laughs> you're going to laugh at me so hard. Um, there is a <laughs> Jekyll and Hyde, I think it was a, a Halloween episode. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Or some shit where the, um, I can't remember which character it was, but they were, it was like a Jekyll and Hyde sequence, fuck. It was a Jekyll and Hyde sequence where they kept turning into Mr. Hyde, and this mm -hmm. music video scared the shit out of me as a child. Like, I didn't that, get... That sounds very familiar. I'll, I'll send it I've to you, that. I'll send it to you after the, um, the recording. Because it, it, it was like... I think I was like eight or nine. It was just him like transformed and hunched over. I was like, Ugh. it was like body dysmorphia. It was very creepy to me. Aw. <laughs> Guess who you're never gonna, wait, bunny, there's a bunny? Yeah, there's a robot bunny. Oh, I did not it's know. A, it's an abomination and a mistake of God. <laughs> Says the pink elephant. That's just adorable. How could you? <laughs> oh, elephant should die. Never mind. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, like it was actually terrifying. And I was trying to think of anything else that actually <laughs> I see Zach going for the ice. I'm gonna yeah. put it on this one because I'm an asshole. Um, but it was it was like I don't mean to say body dysmorphia in a bad way. I'm just saying like it freaked me out. Come well, on! You should sprint when you do that. That's why you're not I jumping. Sh I should. Uh, <laughs> um, it was just like I don't know. I've always had a. I'm learning now that I have. A really, I get really grossed out by blood easily. Like, mm -hmm. blood coming out of a person. And I know that's graphic. Don't, don't you have to clean up blood sometimes at your work? Well, I, I work the trash now, so I, I don't oh, have to okay. work with blood a lot. But in, in, blood on the floor, that's fine. Like, I did that at Smith's. I did that at uh, other places. It's blood actually coming out of a person. Like, if oh, I okay. see okay. that. It's just like... I, I got my blood drawn um, a month or two ago. I could not look at it. I was just like, I cannot look at my arm. I can't see the blood coming out. Yeah. I don't know, it's I just... Once, I once had to have my blood drawn every week for five weeks straight I when actually, I was little. Why, Jesus, why? Uh, because my stomach was all messed up and they oh, couldn't yeah. figure out why. Do they still not know why, or do you, oh, yeah. you figure out? Oh yeah, they still do not... Oh god, I... I, I lived! 
Goodbye. <laughs> um, that's weird. I still don't know what's wrong with your stomach. Like it's such a that's a such God a God hates me. Apparently, <laughs> they if don't. He want... wasn't dead, of course. <laughs> I just wrote a paper on that. <laughs> Did you? Yeah, because that's what Nietzsche said. Oh. Uh. It's just it's ooh gold coin. Is Zach here? There he is. Yeah, it's yeah. Zach. You're very quiet. Oh yeah, I was just, you know, listening. Um... Crap, what were we talking about? Stomach problems. Blood. And then Nietzsche for a moment. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, okay, I, I actually had to, when I was taking um, my acne medicine, I, I had to get my blood drawn too. Because to make sure that there was, oh my god, that was so close. <laughs> to I make sure totally that there was... hit you on my screen. Well, latency. Oh! oh. Um, but yeah, I had to, because I can't remember how strong the medicine was, but it was yeah. pretty freaking strong. What else? Can I grab this? Woohoo! You, you did it. <laughs> I did it. Watch me jump into the propeller blades. Oh, God. I am alive. Don't you, know how. Somehow you are. Um, Zach, do you have any topic that you would like to bring up? Uh... No, of discussion. I've got though. one. So okay. was that the first time you watched Hellraiser the other night, Zach? No, I watched the first and second one ago. Oh my god. <laughs> and, uh, I am the best. It's cool in theory. The first one was creative, <laughs> but then it kind of yeah. strayed. Have away. you ever seen the third one where there's the dude who throws actual just normal CDs at people's heads? And Where it kills them. <laughs> Again, I, I've never seen anything past the second one, so. Oh, uh, okay. Is yeah. Hellraiser always the guy with a bunch of pins in his head? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I thought so. It's, uh. How could you, Kyle? It's, yeah, <laughs> like I said, the first one's creative, and the, the premise of it is pretty nice, but. It's not like really. Like I said, it. it yeah. <laughs> it's just like how any classic movie like that goes. Fun <laughs> fact in the fifth one. There's a uh, fifth one? There's eight or nine, I believe. Jesus. Uh, yeah, um, there's eight. In, in the fifth one... Oh, hey, coin. Now you die. Nope, never mind. Um, in the cry. fifth one, what happens is the original girl comes back, and um, she... her boyfriend kills her. Oh. Okay. But she makes a deal with the pinhead guy to send five new people, including her ex-boyfriend, into his creepy, sadist, fetish world in exchange for becoming free again. So she turns into the evil person in the fifth one. Oh, hey, nice. great. I don't want to go to the pier. But I we're don't want to let... go to the dance party. <laughs> dance party, though, because there's a it's new the item. It's the worst one. Yeah, but there's a new item. Damn it. Let's go to the volcano. Yay! New place. Um, this looks safe. Yeah, it totally looks safe. I'm gonna get a spring. That wall of lava. Okay, so yeah, we have to get up here. So you might want to put the spring. Yeah, this is why I was like, why are you going that way? Put the barrel below it. There you go. I think. Oh, I don't know if the spring would launch us high enough. Though. I think it would. Let's find out. Wait, why are we? Oh God! You didn't notice that I did. <laughs> Please don't be a wave of lava. <laughs> huh. Um. Oh, okay, so another thing that I thought of a long time ago and wanted to bring up was what if, and I, I added a, a caveat to this, but what if um, the world, okay, maybe it doesn't. <laughs> well, shit. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> nope, almost, almost made it. Your corpse made it. I, my corpse made I could have made a postmortem win, postmortem. I said po wait, I said post Morsh Podum. <laughs> is my, how I to say it. Um wait, I'll put a little no, please don't put the hockey box right there. You it's to gonna be the trap door. <laughs> Only the first can make it. How do I rotate? Uh E and Q. This does not or help me on the a controller. Bumpers, bumpers. Ah. Um Oh shit! 
Um, okay, so I, I added a caveat to this because I, I thought it would be interesting. Zach, you are in that platform. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> um, but... <laughs> Into the lava you go. Um, what if people could create tornadoes or natural disasters that gave you diseases? What? That, that oh, is I, such a bizarre question. I know, but I thought of it the other day, and I thought it was really interesting. Because, like, imagine a tornado of cotton candy that gives you diabetes. That is so bizarrely specific. <laughs> this is this is a random. Th I'm gonna rotate this. Um. Oh my God, Kyle. <laughs> But, like, seriously, my my caveat to this is what if the G Geneva Convention didn't exist? What do you think people would have made if we we aren't dead? Like, we, the the human race has survived with the G Geneva Convention not in effect. What do you think people would have made at this point? Like, disease or germ shit, germ-wise. Um... Besides the tornadoes made of... Oh, like, shit, if I... False. If I was a mad scientist, and this is me talking, because I'm a complete weirdo, I would be like, let's make a tidal wave. <laughs> I just thought of the dumbest thing. I was like, let's make a tidal wave and full, full hypodermic needles. <laughs> In all honesty, I think what would have happened is the weaponization of anthrax. Yeah! That, that's what I'm going to go with. Well, okay, if, if any... I, like, I know that... <laughs> I hit the spikes. I know that that would be... That'd be interesting warfare, but, like... What else do you think people would have come up with? Besides weaponized anthrax? I... Well, okay, let's go, let's go back to the first point of... Do you think people would make natural disasters... No. Out of... Too much effort. <laughs> oh, wait, sorry. I... I I would make a fucking tornado made of cotton candy and get Wolford Brimley or whatever the fuck his name is who says diabetes. 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 <laughs> Took my legs. Kyle. Just put it in the wall. <laughs> Kyle. It Kyle. rewards a skilled player. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, it just and gives Zach you... is dead. <laughs> oh, it just gives you a second one now, huh? Now it's time to retry. I'm so tempted. <laughs> Please don't. Do I, no, I don't think it's possible. No, that's why I put that there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, shit, now how do I get back down? <laughs> that is the question, young Padawan. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Nope. Right, In the lava I got. I, I won't do it. I won't do it anymore. <laughs> God you died. It. I had to see if it was possible at that point. I'll blow it up with the next bomb. Ooh, geez. Or I can just move it. I, I can just block it. Okay, uh, going back to the mad scientist thing, it would just be funny to see, <laughs> to see people screaming in terror of a pink tornado coming. <laughs> coming and the air smells like shitty cotton candy. I just, agree. It it's just not, very not practical. I know it's not practical, but I, this is a hypothetical, and I'm just saying, like, this would be the strangest thing. <laughs> I feel like people would make Sharknado before Cotton Candy Nado. Ah, oh, come on. Uh, but that's because of the movie. Also, because Sharknado. They would. You, I would make a fucking <laughs> dinosaur tornado. What about shark with with legs? <laughs> Land shark. Land shark tornado. <laughs> that would okay, be even yeah, more. That would be even more terrifying. Ancient giant sloth tornado. <laughs> Oh! Like, they're not very dangerous, but when they fly out of the tornado, they just weigh so much that they just crush people. Yeah, they people. just crush you. Oh my god. Um... <laughs> iceberg. No, I'm going to the old mansion. Okay. Or we're going to rooftops. Um... Well, my, my other thought was, like, a tidal wave... Uh, wait, what was my other thought? It was, like, tidal wave... Wave babies? No... Why would you say that? <laughs> oh, actually, my my thought exactly was a tornado with AIDS, because then you can make the the tor aid Or tornado. Yeah, yeah, this is I I was making. <laughs> you see my pun? I've killed myself. <laughs> no. How do we do this? I'll do this. Um. Oh God. Wait, the surfboard doesn't move, does it? Yes, it does. It does. Uh. Uh. Oh wait. This does not help me. Oh. Wait, is that <laughs> it's actually not good. Oh god, I'm dying. 
Go, Kyle. I believe in you. Hey, there you go. Get the box. Um. But, like, that was such a... Oh, nice. That was such a random thought that came into my head, and I was just like, I want to ask other people about this. But the Geneva Convention one was specifically for the tornadoes. Like, do you think people would make fucked up tornadoes? If they... If people... This also goes to the government controlling the weather shit. Like, that conspiracy theory that the government can make tornadoes. But they, but they can't. I... This is a conspiracy theory. Anything can happen in conspiracy theory. It's <laughs> my motto. <laughs> Anything's like, it's, oh shit. Uh, oh no. Oh, you've oh, doomed us all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the surfboard, Kyle. Join me. Join my body on the surfboard. It was just... I don't know. That was such a random thought. And I'm like, I, what the hell? <laughs> Can you jump while doing that now? No, I didn't actually hit the end there. Oh, did you? <laughs> um. Oh, crap. What was my other thing? Oh, that was another one. These are these are completely random thoughts that I had at work. I'm just going to make this side of the wall more dangerous. Oh, God. Um, but there... So the Geneva Convention one, I thought of like some kind of, like, water. You know, like, the water, like, the pure water you told me about. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Something like that, where you can just pour it into water, and it would just eradicate people. <laughs> there was also my thought of... <laughs> this is gonna be... This is gonna be weird, and sound weird, but the Philosopher's Stone from <laughs> Full Metal Alchemist. I thought you were gonna go with from Harry Potter. No. <laughs> that goes back to the conversation we had before we started recording. Oh. Okay. Thought Which you ought to was? know. Oh yes. Oh damn it! I wanted to see if I could make it to that. I wanted to be cool. <laughs> Unfortunately, being cool uh, doesn't make you immune to death. It does if you're pretty enough. <laughs> it also does <laughs> or if you're something. <laughs> it also does if you. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you're pretty enough. You're immune to death. You're so pretty. Well, okay, that didn't happen. Oh, the X's on your eyes are really cute. Yeah, I really like dead, you know, <laughs> elephants. Okay, um... What was I gonna say? Oh, okay, so everyone, you know, people people always go with, uh... Oh, if you could live in any video game world, what would it be? Um... My, this is not my question. My question is... If you had, if, if a video, like, I was thinking of Dark Souls specifically. Mm -hmm. Um, if video games, oh god, you made the surfboard more dangerous. <laughs> oh, damn it. Um. Oh, no. <laughs> if, if, P, if, like, video games had, like, if Dar the characters in Dark Souls had. Oh, shit, you made that impossible. <laughs> if, damn. Uh, if. Uh, the characters in Dark Souls, like every NPC, every enemy you killed, mm -hmm. had feelings. Like if you were killing them over and over again and they could feel it, would you feel bad about it? In video games? Yes, not specifically Dark Souls, but that's what I was thinking. So just... Like if you kill someone in a video game and they they feel it and they were like... Squ oh no, my specific thought was um, if you... Shit! If you um were playing a video game, and because you know how in Dark Souls Three the thing on the bridge, if you parry it and you leave it on its back, it prays. Mm -hmm. I was thinking if something was sobbing and crying and begging you not to kill it, would you Probably feel? Not. I would. I would not. Feel bad. <laughs> well, you're you. I I know. I know you wouldn't. But I I was mostly like. <laughs> I was mostly asking. Just because that's an interesting concept, because there's a lot of games these days with paths where you can pick, like, the kill everybody path or the I want to be a good guy path, like going with uh, Bioshock. Yeah, I, I often pick the good guy path just because it's yeah. harder. It's, yeah, it is harder because you get less power ups, or, well, yeah. specifically speaking in Bioshock's form, you get, like, less power ups in the beginning. You don't get as much uh, power, but you get rewarded later. For it, you should put that there. So yeah, yeah, you. yeah, that's the plan. Uh, um, and but here. <laughs> well then, <laughs> at least we have a long running point. Oh my god, I almost died. 
Hey, you got the error friend. Um, is it for me? Yeah, I died. <laughs> this is the one where you <laughs> stop having me in a glue party. I can't see it. <laughs> what are you doing in there? Not jacking my trunk. <laughs> You're not making sexy elf noises. Even, I don't even get a full point for being the only one there now. Um. Yeah, no, it's it's like it's specifically harder. It's it's difficult to be the good guy <laughs> in a lot of games. Um, which I enjoy because the bad path makes me feel like a horrible person. <laughs> but the bad path is usually like way more fun though. Yeah, well, it's it goes to the G that okay. Thank you, latency. Oh my god. Um, but like in in uh. In GTA, like that's a game of only being the bad guy. That's <laughs> well, true, yeah. If there's games like that where I would play that and be like, yeah, this is what I'm gonna do. But in a game like Bioshock or um or oh my god, why can't I think of the game? He has electric powers, and you can pick good or I can't remember the freaking game. Electric powers. Infamous. Infamous. Okay. Have you played Infamous? No, I have not. It's a fun game. Um, he gets electric powers, and in the second one, you can you can be good or evil. And if you're evil, you suck the life out of people. That's hot. <laughs> yeah, it's it's literally like you drain them of their electricity. It's pretty, and that's that. I think that's one of the only games where I picked the bad path because that was really fun to do. Because I'm just like, hey. Plus, plus, um, you get a choice of fire or ice powers later. Mm, okay. And it doesn't matter if you're good or evil if you pick the fire or ice power. Wait, maybe it's... No, I think you get a choice. Oh, God. I did not see that. Um, but yeah, no, the, the ice powers are more lean towards good and the fire powers are more towards evil. Mm, gotcha. And so they're, it's it's like a super. I think this is only the the second one is where you get the fire and ice powers. I haven't played Second Sun, but I've heard it's good. The new one for the PS4, I've heard it's good. I don't know it. I know because you haven't played any of them. Could have heard of it though. <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> and you took it from me. <laughs> Could have, woulda, shoulda. What? Heard if it's good? Yeah. Don't don't take my word for it. How Wait. did you run through that? Yeah. What the Are hell? You some kind of lizard man? Maybe. <laughs> Are you the Zuck? <laughs> the Zuck? He is not Zuckerberg. Um. The great powerful wizard of Suck. It's nice to know that I've won three times and Zach has almost caught up immediately. <laughs> <laughs> um. Let's see you run through this one. Fuck boy. Also, Zach, like, I also want you to talk for a second, but we keep talking. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. you, you've all seemed to. No, it's just I, I had topic. Oh, oh my god, you tried. <laughs> well, <laughs> we are the best. Death comes swiftly for those who least expect it. <laughs> um. If you blow it up, I'm just gonna replace it with arrows. I'm destroying the bottom one. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> there you go. Um, it's it's mostly just because I had topics prepared of things I thought about. Yeah. <laughs> Why can't I? Okay, there we go. Oh, the arrows get turned back. Ah! Oh, oh my no. god, I'm alive! <sighs> yes! Solo points. If I can- oh shit! <laughs> I got trapped on my own water spout trap. You've activated my trap, K. <laughs> You've activated my water spout, aka a fire hose. You've activated my dick. <laughs> you know, I wasn't gonna go there, Kyle, but you can you can go there. Um There we go. Make it a narrow margin. Oh yeah, the arrows do just shit, get stuck. Boom. Almost. Well, <laughs> death comes swiftly. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> um, <laughs> now I'm activating another <laughs> trap card. <laughs> there we go. 
Um. Oh, what else? Just you're the worst. <laughs> There's. Like what else? Kyle showed me a fucking that. Oh, look at that arrow go. Oh, Kyle showed me the fucking food. Uh, oh god, I got hit by the arrow. Are you serious? I forgot about the boat. The boat um, left me. <laughs> the the boat comes back though. Um, I tried to be stylish. So the, I Kyle showed me a. Uh, clip from the food porn anime. Ah, uh, yes, Shokugeki. Yeah. Zach has watched that as well. Oh, has he? Yes. Kyle showed me a scene from that and I'm like, I need to watch this. I, I've also wanted to rewatch. I gotta place that better. I could all, I, I've wanted to uh, watch rewatch One Punch Man. Cause... I've watched that too many times for me to care again. <laughs> How many times have you watched it? At least five. Jesus. I mean, I, saw, I know it's a good show and all. <laughs> I didn't expect you. Oh, damn it! I didn't expect you to like it that much. I really liked it. I know it's great. Zach, have you watched that? I hope you've watched that. One Punch. One Punch. Yeah, I've, I've I too have seen it too many times. I've only seen I've only watched through it once and seen the fucking now now scene. now that you've brought it up, who other than Saitama and. Moomin. And fuckface McGuy, I don't care about. What, Moomin? Yeah, no, Genos. Oh, okay. Moomin's I was, the best. Okay, I was uh, gonna be like, who, you who ass. is your favorite character? Can I say, are we excluding Moomin? Because I no, love I Moomin. Guess you, I guess you could pick Moomin, that'd be fine. I, okay, um. Besides, I'm gonna go with besides Moomin, because I do love Moomin. Okay. Um. I am dead. What? <laughs> was that? Breaks in your favor. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> That I get hit by oh, the normal ass no. ice. <laughs> nice. We're the best. Um, let's see, who else? There's the water. The samurai was pretty interesting. I, yeah. I am always a fan of Puri Puri Prisoner. Oh, yeah, Puri Puri. <laughs> the guy everyone else but Kendall hates. <laughs> Maybe not hates. Not loves as much no, as. Oh, yeah, no. I Hates is probably the most accurate part. Yeah. <laughs> Not many people besides me like him. I love Piri Piri. I have a freaking t-shirt of him. I'll have to take a picture of it and put he's in the... He's the fucking man. He is. He's so great. I do like Speedo Sound, but he's also just a giant asshole. And his fucking lame smile. Yeah. You know who I like? Who is not technically a villain, or not tech? Yeah, not technically a villain or a hero. The fucking hmm. guy who doesn't have a job <laughs> and is fighting speed of sound. You know who I'm talking about? The bald guy. Oh, yes, Hammerhead. Yes, yes. Hammerhead. I love Hammerhead. He's such a fucking. He's like. <laughs> he's such a dork. He's like, I don't have any power. No, wait. He's incredibly strong, isn't he? He does have powers. Yeah. I was well, just... no, he doesn't have powers. He has a suit. Oh, that's right. That's right. And then he, he goes. to have a suit. Then he goes to jail, right? No. He uh, just... No, he gets his job. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's to find a job. Uh, that's right. I love him. Okay, so between between uh, Moomrin, Pri Pri, and uh, or Piri Piri, and uh, Hammerhead, it would probably be Moomin first, Piri Piri second, and then Hammerhead third, like in my order of not Saitama or Genos. Yeah. Cause Genos is okay. <laughs> yeah, he's he's not the best. He's not the best, but he's a good sidekick. Zach, if you don't grab that door and put it at the entrance to the house. <laughs> thank you. Perfect. <laughs> now we have a house to live in. Just gotta complete the illusion. Yeah, there Perfect. we go. <laughs> <laughs> I like how we all went for completing the illusion. Let us head. <laughs> you made you made a wall and I made a makeshift wall on some broken glass. We living like hobos tonight, boys. <laughs> Kyle. Uh, uh, well, I'm taking I guess, the elevator. <laughs> I guess I'm playing the waiting game. <laughs> One dollar, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> One job, Bob. One dollar, Bob. One job? What? You heard me. That sounds like either a porn star, rapper, or some kind of candy. That's gonna be my porn in one jaller bob. <laughs> one jaller bob. 
<laughs> you have to have Christmas balls near on your underpants. <laughs> yes. Uh, <laughs> you like what you see, boys? They jingle. <laughs> oh my god, I've created too much an illusion. <laughs> I believe in you, That's Zach. not kosher. There you go. We have to wait to be let in. Like peasants. Oh god! How did. Did, you, did I phase through the door for either of you guys? No, but you faced through many, many bolts before that one hit you. <laughs> I have been hit by three bolts on my screen and crushed by the elevator. <laughs> Look at those! Those are tiny ass points. Just like the jingle Christmas balls that will be on your underpants. I'm trying to imagine you in this position and I'm like, I need to stop. <laughs> Why would you do that to my crossbow? Ow. I forgot about that. I didn't even see you place that. <laughs> um. <laughs> so instead of a... What the hell? Oh, I just saw the bolt go diagonal. I was like, what the hell just happened? Um. Oh, Ferris wheel. Da, 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 circus. It's the most annoying part of the movie. <laughs> do you know what I'm talking about? Probably. I don't. Not. <laughs> Zach knows. Sadly, I do, yeah. Yeah, I've watched that movie, too. <laughs> what movie? It's, uh... Madagascar, Madagascar 3. Madagascar 3. Oh, okay. It's, it's out... Fuck. It's the zebra, and he's in a clown outfit, and he's just singing about how he's in the circus, and it's... Like, it, it was on the... What the hell? I... Uh, I call bullshit on that. Elevator growing up. <laughs> I'll see myself at. <laughs> yeah. There was a picture I saw recently of, of Willem Dafoe, where I almost went for that portal, <laughs> um, of Willem Dafoe, <laughs> where it was a picture of him smiling, and it's like, okay, so we need you to look like you ate uh, 17, uh, someone's butterfly collection and have 17 erasers up your butt, and it's just him normally smiling. <laughs> <laughs> it's really funny. Oh shit! Oh. <laughs> we put too much shit at the beginning. I like how I put a second door. <laughs> it wasn't dangerous enough. It's the foyer. <laughs> yeah, that's the time. Wait, nope. Now we have to. <laughs> I'm just gonna make this fucking tight. No, don't destroy my doors. <laughs> no. <laughs> You've destroyed my home. The illusion is shattered. <laughs> you broke my home. Ow! I got hit by a hockey puck. I'm so afraid. <laughs> Should be. We made a machine of death. <laughs> Do you like that? Oh my god, that arrow nearly clocked you in the head. And by clocked, I went through your head. <gasps> no! Oh Wait, my what? god. How did you. Oh, he's just hitting off screen! <laughs> anyway. I'm killing myself. <laughs> you already did. <laughs> All the doors must pay for that. No! Crime. You <laughs> did it your own. Gone. No! You did it on your own. Also, there's a coin no one could reach. <laughs> you wanna try for it, Kyle? I do, but I didn't see where you put it. <laughs> Very top of the map. Oh my god. Oh, oh. damn it. Ow. Oh my god. At the god. very top of the map, you yeah. say? Right there. Oh my god. Okay, I have to make it literally impossible. Got it. <laughs> I still got less than half a total point for all <laughs> Well then. Get rid of this, this stupid ass machine. I don't care about the fireball launcher, I just want that hockey puck thing gone. It's so obnoxious. It's very obnoxious. Um. What's a good movie I've seen recently? <laughs> I don't think I've seen. Oh, I, I as I did was. Did you ever see? Did either of you see A Quiet Place? No, no. You said ow. You said it was okay. I. It was very good. I really liked it. Oh, did you? Oh, wait. What was that movie where you wouldn't shut up about a guy decapitating oh, his yeah, sister? Oh yeah, that, that was Hereditary. That's right. That's right. That's what that was. The movie that the person was covered in ants. Ants, 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 ants. No. No, you and your ants. 
Um, I need answers. Get it? <laughs> okay. I'll see myself out. <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh yeah, that's right, Zach. I don't know if I told you, uh, because I think we talked about Black Panther. Shit. We talked about Black Panther when we were hanging out, but I didn't talk about Ready Player One with you. I don't think. Because I talked yeah. about it with Kyle. Um, it was like if trash, right? Yeah, that's no, it was trash. But I'm trying to like explain it for. Hey, I got a trap point because you tied on my elevator <laughs> or my Ferris wheel of not being <laughs> useful chance. at all. Um, so I'm just gonna put the Kyle. What I want you to do: put the spike ball on the other cheese. Just, that makes it too easy. No, why? Too How does it make it too easy? easy? Cause now you can't take the elevator to win. Oh god. I was trying to park Now you have to do this convoluted thing right over here and not get crushed like I did. <laughs> <laughs> um so Ready Player One was literally like if pop culture vomited all over uh a classic book Yes <laughs> So it's just a new Deadpool <laughs> movie. No, I like Deadpool. <laughs> Yeah, but that is just vomiting pop culture. No, cuz no, cuz Deadpool is like the Deadpool movie portrayed it correctly. Like, well, okay. They did a good job. Like Ryan Reynolds is a good Deadpool. He plays the character well, he gives it a lot of attitude. He does it well. In Ready Player 1, it was just reference after reference after reference after reference after reference. Like, there is a scene where the main character is pulled aside by Goro from Street Fighter. Oh, shit. You're alive still, yeah. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that was not a me killing myself. That was me jumping in the Oh, so he's pulled aside by Goro. He's pulled aside by Goro, and um, he's, like, pulled into this, like, secret room, whatever. This is after the first challenge has been beaten. If mm -hmm. you care, I don't really care. Um, but did my controller break? What happened? Hello? What the fuck? <laughs> what happened? We're just slowly zooming in on nothing. <laughs> I think that was the game because there's nothing showing up there for me either. Is my controller broken? Wait, okay, I have to unplug. Um, so he's pulled aside by Goro, uh, which, you know in the oasis you can be anything you want so it's it's a person yeah. um but the reference then is uh he is pulled aside by goro a the alien worm thing from aliens pops out of his chest mm -hmm. then it eats up the costume of goro because it wasn't actually goro and reveals the second main character and she has the alien thing on her hand and then in the next 15 seconds, they're referencing Superman with the glasses. And I know I know this is a video game world where anything is possible, but you threw in like four references into something I Control barely care friends. about. And, and Zach, the other thing before I, I left, um, because this really kind of annoyed me, was in, um, there's this big fight scene in this floating dance club, and the music, the music that was playing was Staying Alive by the Bee Gees. Hell yes. <laughs> and, and I'm sitting here like, okay, so you picked the most obvious music for a fight scene in which you're going to stay alive. It was just, it was just vomiting pop culture. Do you, do you think when when the Bee Gees created their band name that they actually thought like, hey, in five years we're gonna be known as the Blowjobs? <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's the thing. Oh, you got a sheep glass. Oh, that's that's not a platform there. Shit. <laughs> Good job, Zach. Hey, thanks. Yes, sweeped us. I promise we'll be more we're, we'll be more prepared to let you speak next time, Zach. <laughs> No, it's okay. Uh, but totally uh, it. Zach's a little pig boy. <laughs> All right. <laughs> he sleeps in the dirt. Um, now I can't tell which if which one's gonna pull the other plow. Oh, oh damn neither. it! Okay. I thought it was gonna work. Um. I don't know. It's. Also, I don't know if the Bee Gees thought that. Do you think? Do you think they would be happy about that or sad about that? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it picture. could be a little of both. That's fair. We are known as the blowjobs. 
<laughs> we make sweet Ca music. <laughs> For skinema. Kyle, I see that. <laughs> My skinema sins. <laughs> My skinema sins. <laughs> Is this new porn channel? Yeah. You raise like, that's not realistic. <laughs> that's not realistic. <laughs> Last more than 20 seconds. <laughs> Kyle, not all of us <laughs> finished. I don't know. Oh, we both grabbed it. Cool. Let's put it right here, Zach. Right, right, right. right. Oh, you sadist. There you go. Try for it, Kyle. I dare you. I am. I'm going to stay here and watch. Oh, my God. Uh, oh, you can go through the middle of that? Yeah, that's how I died on the first thing. Oh. I died because I was stupid. Uh, <laughs> oops. Muskinema sense. They call me Mr. Cash for Gold. <laughs> and I still didn't beat Zach's single victory. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Oh. You should make this thing more dangerous. Are you get add some Paula Dean on there, man. That's cheese. But everyone else calls it butter. Yeah, but butter's not sticky. It can be if it's really old. <laughs> Ew. First <laughs> off. Just oh. like Paula Dean. <laughs> uh, okay, I. Do you have anything else you want to talk about, Kyle? Yes. And that would be the new Smash. Okay, okay. The new. Who here's getting it? Well, of course I'm getting uh, it. I don't own Switch. So yeah. <laughs> well, you, but you could save for a Switch because it doesn't come out till December. Yeah, it doesn't come out for a while. Then. Also, then... Christmas presents. Yeah. There's all that's... sorts of ways to get things. That's that's, that's how I got my really... Switch was a Christmas present. Oh. Fair enough. So. Is that something you maybe want for your Christmas present? I'm not gonna get it for you, of course, because that's was, way too much money. I was gonna I was, say, God. I, I know the way the way I said I said that implied that I'd get it, but you no, bought I'm a fifty dollar game person. for me for whatever goddamn reason. No, my death trap. There's no. But maybe, I mean. You should. It's it's a great console with a lot of good hardware. Yeah. Mm, also, that Breath of the Wild. Yeah, it's it's pretty good. Oh shit. That didn't happen, okay? Time out, guys. Time out. <laughs> I'm recording this. And Zach is already going to be ahead of me. <laughs> um, oh shit. He's going to be very ahead now. The door opens for you. Now it closes. <laughs> <laughs> did, that uh, did that actually make you laugh? <laughs> yeah, I'm just, I'm just blown away by how more difficult this is for me. Oh, I thought you were laughing at the stupid joke I made. Um, oh god. <laughs> Yay, it's becoming more dangerous again. <laughs> um. Oh, I make the, the fire curve to make it even oh more horrible. Oh my god, I didn't notice that. Shit. Zach might sweep us. Uh, Holy crap, that was so close. Um, he can't sweep us, I have points. He's, he's, he's winning a lot. <laughs> No, but sweeping someone means they don't get any points. Kyle, I'm not good with gaming terminology. <laughs> That's just general sports. <laughs> I'm not a sports person. That's the thing we should talk about is sports. <laughs> sports? Do you do the sports? <laughs> uh, I used to when I was young and fit. <laughs> now you're... Now you're Neither of these things. <laughs> Kyle, I'm four years older than you. Yeah, but it's still true. Uh, just young was the part that got me. <laughs> no. Young and fit. Yeah. Back in the day. Back in the day, where, uh... In the days for rock and roll. How do you... With oh. Wireless. I still have no accessories for the whole hey. front. Hey. Oh, I have <gasps> I have rain boots. Yes, this is made so much better. Um, 
Anyway, you... back to Smash. <laughs> okay, how, okay. how do you think? How do you think it's gonna go? I think it's gonna do be you think pretty it's gonna fun. Be good or... I think it's gonna be fun, but they're going to. I I want them to have, um, like if you have. Did did they announce anything for Amiibos? Like, did they do anything for Amiibos? I think they did, but I'm not remembering. That's surprising because like they have so many characters. I just don't like. I think. Oh yeah, there's a. I know there's a Ridley one. Yeah, because Ridley's a character. Yeah. So they they're adding a Ridley one, but oh, other God. than that, I don't know. Well, wait. What would the Ridley one do? I thought you could just unlock them in the game. I I know, but there's a Ridley amiibo. Yeah, I know. I'm saying, what would it do? It's an amiibo. They're all worthless trash. <laughs> oh. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. It's like the first thing Zach has said. It's so long. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't give, I don't care about amiibos either, but you know. I'm making a death trap. The, the worth of an amiibo is definitely. A... I was surprised at how fucking manic people were in getting them. Uh, yeah. Well, I mean, people collecting them and all that. You know, it's it's like a, an extra reason why people collect figurines is like they, they do something. Yeah, it's that's fair. It's just, I can't imagine Amiibos going for, like, I, I skipped the the craziness of, hey, this Amiibo is worth 50 to $70. You. What? Zach. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I love that it explodes now. Like, the little parts go everywhere. Yeah. Um, oh, my headphones drop. Oh, God. Woo! Um, gonna kill myself so you guys can get points. Shit. <laughs> um, I just I can't imagine. I mean, I guess I buy vintage video games that I go for mm -hmm. several hundred dollars. <laughs> that makes more sense than amiibos. Too. Yeah, it does, cause those are plastic, and that's an actual cartridge from like six. No, it's not sixty years ago. I am over exaggerating. How long ago was that? I have the original Final Fantasy oh. with the book. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> well then, take my headphones. Take my Beats by Dre. Take it. I've done it. I've achieved a single victory. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, technically in the game it's honey. Hmm. Interesting. Yes, complete my. Oh god, oh god, oh god. There we go. <laughs> Welcome to the moving. The moving pain. Ah, <laughs> shit. <laughs> I'm slowly creating a firing spot. I mean, I've, I'm making a death trap, so don't worry. Um. What was it? Oh, I have the original Final Fantasy. When did the original Final Fantasy come out? 19... That is a good question. I Wait, I have know. I have the box. I can just check on the fucking on the fucking box. Get him standing up. You can make it actually possible. 1987. I wonder if that curves though. 1987 is when this came out. Oh. And yes, I I do agree that that's a lot better than amiibos, and I'm already dead. Sweet. <laughs> We all died immediately due to the firing squad. Good job. Um. But yeah, no, I, I just like, I don't get it. It just, it's kind I of mean, like, it's kind of like the Beanie Baby craze, where I'm like, why are people buying stuff, and sure, what? Kyle, how am I alive? Shit. <laughs> Shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> I did some like. Matrix shit under that. Um, what else was really popular that I did not understand? The Paul Brothers. <laughs> now, see, that's something that just cannot be explained by science. That cannot be exp explained by anyone. Well, fuck. <laughs> nice. <Well done>. <laughs> we are the best. Well, there I go. Um... What else? Oh, I I got because Zach's also a, a Pokemon fan. I yes. What, what do you think of the new Pokemon, Zach? We'll end it off with that. What do you, what do oh. you think about the new Pokemon? 
Uh, I have some words for this as well. I know, this are is why I'm asking him specifically. Are we talking about Hey You Pikachu hey or you, not? Or not? Hey You Pikachu! Or whatever it's called? Hey You Pikachu! Like an old ass game! Like the GameCube! No, that's something. Nintendo 64! Oh, it's even older. It's old, that's before. Which one's the one with Pikachu and Eevee? And that's the one! Hey You Pikachu! <laughs> They just need to bring that back. <laughs> they is do. That the game is that the game you're asking me about? Yeah, or... yeah, yeah. What do you think of the um? It, the... it just feels like an expansion pack for Pokemon Go. Yeah. Kyle, Kyle which, explained which... it. Sorry, go ahead. Well, cause, cause, I mean, the game's been out for so long, and it's had such like a cult following. That and oh, such, God. such a Poor such Smartum? a history. With hey. It. With like reported accidents of people playing Pokemon Go on the highways and and it, and it being on television news, yeah, and people dying. I'm slowly and, and getting even pushed. Just just recently, they finally added trading and finally after and a how long? List. It's uh, I can't remember how long it's a been. A year, probably to Kyle. Uh, probably two <laughs> yeah. years, maybe longer. What? Suck a dick. But I mean, I I mean, I played. Oh God! It, I mean, I would back when it first came out. I was playing the shit out of it. Oh yeah, no, I played it. <laughs> I get trapped. Get <laughs> trapped. <laughs> shit. Where's your teleporter ass now? And Not just... alive. Oh wait, yes, alive. Um, I oh, no, shit. I agree. I I remember. Um, this is a Pokemon Go story, and I'm sorry if... No, I don't care if Jeffrey doesn't... I have told so many fucking stories with Jeffrey that I don't think he cares at this point. But uh. he, uh, uh, we went to a gym. There was a church near your guys' house, Kyle. Like, uh, a few streets. Okay. You know where I'm talking about? By that convenience yes. store that we stopped at? Um, yeah. I see you going towards that fan, motherfucker. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I hate you. I hope you know that. I'm going for it too. We're all going for it. Shit. Cause Kyle likes to cheat. <laughs> Kyle, we had one rule. <laughs> we had one rule. <laughs> Rules are meant to be broken. <laughs> oh God, Zach. <laughs> That's a weird thing now. Um. But yeah, no. We we went to that church near the uh, near your guys' house at like 10:30. Okay. Um, and it was it was really f well. <laughs> I guess we're not telling that story.